Pastor George Borkhart, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. Did God forget me? That's the subject of the day's Higher Things Video Short. Sometimes, when things get a little lonely, when um, we're down, when and out, when we're sick, not feeling well, when we're lonely, we might think that God has forgotten us. We might think that he has sort of taken the day off from being God. I'm sorry, I'm not available, leave a message. And, and it's easy to think that way. When you think of God in sort of transcendent terms, as being way up in the heavens and we are way down here. What is God that he's mindful of me? What, what does he care about someone? What does he care about my day and my good and my the good things that happen to me. This is a good week for that kind of question. Reminiscari, second week of Lent, is about God remembering his tender mercies to us, his covenant faithful to us. To us. You see, we pray that God would remember to be good to us, that he would remember us in Christ. And not just that he would think on us, because if, if he thought on us when it, and it comes to the law, he would only punish us. But that he would think on us in Christ Jesus, in our baptism, in the word, in, the, in his body and blood, that he would be for us as a child of God and not by what we do or don't do. You see, when we, when we feel distant from God, it's not that God has gotten distant from us. It's that we've gotten distant from God. It's, it's, that, it's that we have let ourselves think that our standing with God is somehow dependent upon what's going on with us and how we're feeling and what we're doing at the particular time. And we've forgotten that God is imminent in his Son. He's right here with me. He's by our side upon the plain with his good gifts and spirit. That in my baptism, he has marked me as one who has been redeemed by Christ the crucified. In his word, I will never taste death. In his body and blood, I will have life. That his presence with me depends on his gifts, not on me and what is going on and not on my feelings. God doesn't forget his promises, so he can't forget us. He has promised to be with, with his gifts, and he, he's going to carry us through because of his promises, not because of our faithfulness. Well, how do I feel better about myself then? Well, I look outside myself. I look to Christ and what he did for me and not inside myself. I repent of the idea that God is somehow far of me. And I run to his gifts, which enliven me to believe that he hasn't forgotten about me, not today or not ever. And I pray the psalm, the introit, for this week and remind God to remember his mercies because I need him to remember his mercies. I need him to remember his covenant faithfulness to me. I need him to be, remember to be kind to me because of the suffering and death of Christ and not to treat me as my sins deserve. It's all on Christ and not on me. And God's distance from me and his mindfulness of me doesn't rest on me. It rests on his gifts to me. If I locate God's presence inside of me and how I feel, I'll only be certain of God's presence with me when I feel like he's there, when I feel good. And I need to know that God is with me when things are bad. And the way, that, the way that is made known to me and certain is in his gifts, in the, in, in the water, in the word, in his bread and wine. God hasn't forgotten me. He can't. I'm the baptized and I will live forever with him. I'm Pastor George Borkard, and this has been another Higher Things video short.